Today we're gonna unbox the new Painted Pumpkins Mystery Disney Pin Set. What's up everyone, it's Ryan from Disney Pins Blog, back with another Disney Pin Unboxing video. I have eight boxes of the new Painted Pumpkins uh, Mystery Pin Set from ShopDisney.com. There are a total of 10 pins in this Mystery Pin Set. Here is a look at all the ones that we could possibly get in this collection. We got Pumpkin Mickey there at the top, which he's also in the front of the box there. He looks like a ghost. We have Duffy Bear Pumpkin, Orange Bird, which is my favorite. That's the one I really want to get. A Cheshire Cat, a strange looking Flounder Pumpkin, a dual pumpkin of Oogie Boogie and Jack Skellington, Tigger Pumpkin, another uh, dual pumpkin there. We got uh, Solly and a little baby Mike Wazowski Pumpkin. And then the uh, Alien from Toy Story, and finally Baymax from Big Hero 6. So this was released on ShopDisney.com on August 10th, 2020. And I'm not 100% sure, but I feel like this was going to be the mystery pin set for Mickey's Not-So-Scary Halloween Party here at Walt Disney World. Which, of course, the parties have been canceled this year. I think they might have repurposed this a little bit um, and released it online instead. And these sold out super quickly. I'm not sure exactly how long they're up on the website for, but... I know they did go on the first day of the drop. So yeah, like I mentioned, I got eight boxes. I really just want the orange bird here. And just to take a closer look at all of them together, share them with you guys. Here we go, let's get in our first box. Two randomly selected per box. And since this is a limited release collection, the retail price is $20. Let's see what we get right off the rip. All right, what's our first pumpkin gonna be? We got Baymax, Big Hero 6 Baymax Pumpkin. And this is a limited release. You can see it there on the back with the official Disney pin trading logo. We have pretty simple design here. This has the white enamel paint, the two eyes for Baymax, and the little stem there at the top. And it looks like this is a gold tone finish, I believe, a very light gold finish. Cool, first pin, Baymax, that's a good one. Just wanted to show you the side of the box there as well. It does say 10 pin collection. I know I already mentioned that, but a little side view of the box. These are hard to rip because they have little papers in the bags. All right, our second one here is the uh, Monsters, Inc. Pumpkins. Solly and Mike Wazowski. That is a nice one. Here's a little comparison with Baymax. Still very nice size pins. All right, so there's our first box. Wonderful be able to complete the 10 pin collection. We'll see. We have 16 pins in total, um, and only 10 pins, of course, to complete the set. Pin number three. Uh, is this a double? Is this a Baymax? Oh no, it's Ghost Mickey. I just saw the white there. So this is the one that's on the front of the mystery box. Mickey Mouse with the, uh, he's got like two little pumpkins up there for ears. Again, pretty simple here. Not too many colors, just the white, the black for the... Uh, mouth, nose, and eyes, and then the little uh, stem there at the top. Pin number four. Oh, this is our first double. We got Baymax. Oh well, good pin to have a double of. Okay, box number three. What do we got? Oh, Cheshire Cat. There he is, looking crazy. Different tones of pink on this pin, yellow for his eyes. Nice looking pin, good size. Next, second pin for this box. It's hard to rip, man. Okay, we have, oh yes, the one I wanted, Orange Bird. And he's a smaller pumpkin. But look how nice and bright that orange is. I love that. Just a happy looking bird. It's got a little green up there, which is a nice touch. Little accent there on the pumpkin. Awesome, the one I wanted. I do have a small collection of Orange Bird pins. Okay, moving on to our fourth box. So far we have five out of 10, we are halfway there. All right, what's we got next here? Oh, Flounder, the strange looking pumpkin. I don't, I don't know why, but to me, he looks like he's like old, like a grandpa Flounder. <laughs> Doesn't look like uh, he's just an old Flounder, the way that, that pumpkin shape there. I don't know, maybe just me. But uh, nice colors here, very bright yellow and got the blue there on the sides. Just a uh, different shaped pumpkin there. But hey, pumpkins come in all shapes and sizes, right? All right, second pin for this box, our fourth box. What do we got? Uh, looks like a double, let's say another Mickey Mouse. So there we have it, our second double. We have two Mickeys and two Baymax. Okay, we are halfway there, four more boxes to go. And we still have 
5 out of 10. What's this? Oh, we got something unique here. Nightmare Before Christmas. This is a unique pin. I like this with the double pumpkin there. Oogie Boogie and Jack Skellington. It looks like that actually might glow in the dark. I'm not sure. It's hard to tell. It probably needs charged up if it uh, does glow in the dark. But uh, yeah, there we have Nightmare Before Christmas. Jack and Oogie. Okay, we have 6 out of 10. Oh, another unique. The Alien from Toy Story. I love this lime green on this pumpkin. Very bright and colorful. This actually might be my second favorite one. Another unique shape there, all more of a wide looking pumpkin for the alien face. All right, we got eight out of 10. So what do we need? We still need Duffy Bear pumpkin and Tigger. The last two we need. I'm assuming we'll be getting lots of doubles here. Oh, we got Tigger. Nice, now we know we need nine out of 10. This is a uh, nice looking pumpkin as well. Orange used, of course, for Tigger. The black stripes, a little bit of yellow there on his face. This is a uh, duller looking orange compared to the orange bird pin. There you can see orange bird is more of like a, a neon orange. But yeah, Tigger is looking good here on this pumpkin pin. Okay, just one more guys, Duffy. What do we got? Oh, no, a double. It's another Oogie Boogie. A great looking pin, double there. So doubles on Mickey, Baymax, and Night Before Christmas. Two boxes remaining here. Can we complete this set with Duffy Bear? Let's go. I know Jen is a big fan of Duffy Bear. I'm sure she would love to see that pin. Oh, there it is. We completed the set. Our 10th pin, we got little Duffy Bear. Yeah, I'm gonna have to send a picture of this and show Jen. I think she would love this one. I need to have her back on the podcast soon. It's just been hard with the uh, quarantine and everything. But there we go, our 10th pin in the Painted Pumpkins Mystery Pin Collection. And uh, yeah, the backs are the same on all of these pins. That's why I didn't show them. Um, only the first one there. But yeah, they all have the official pin trading logo and say limited release at the bottom. So that's it. We complete the set, guys. We still have another box left and one more pin for this box. Let's just run through them real quick. See what doubles we get here. Cheshire Cat double. Okay, our last box. That was a good one. So we completed it in, out of uh, 14 possible pins opening, we completed the set. That was pretty good. Another uh, Grandpa Flounder pin. All right, our final mystery pin. Let's see here. Another Tigger. There he is. So we've got doubles on Tigger, Night Before Christmas, Flounder, Mickey, Baymax, and Cheshire Cat. So pretty cool. I'm glad we got to take a closer look at the painted pumpkins mystery pin set together. I will leave a link below to the blog post at Disney Pins Blog in case you guys want to find out any other additional information on this set. But um, like I did mention before, this set is sold out at shopdisney.com. Not sure if they're going to restock or not since it is limited release. That might, um, that might have been it. But hope you guys enjoyed. I will show you a closer look at the pins now together. Thanks for watching. See ya.